It's gray. These are gorgeous. Okay, they got the three different sizes right here. It's very pretty. I get up in the morning, throw this shit in like a little ponytail. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> and I'm out of the damn door. Why are you so happy anyway? You must I'm getting ready for my therapy session. I have not been going on a regular basis. I pay for these services out of my pocket. And so therefore I will go when I feel like I need to go. Let's just be honest, you know what I'm saying? You know, I'm sure you guys have seen this like all over the news. It's been like, what's going on with Kate, uh, Princess of Wales. Everybody was wondering like, where has she been, you know? And then the news came out today that she actually has cancer. That's pretty scary. I wish her all the best, you know? I do. I hate to see anybody sick. One of my friends went through cancer and she recovered. She had breast cancer. She's a true fighter. She's a true fighter. She was working her ass off too. She was still at work, working while she was going through treatments and all that kind of stuff. And she did her thing, you know. You know what's so sad is that um, some people... They still have to work when they're going through treatments, cancer treatments and stuff. And you would think that these jobs would be a little bit more understanding. But unfortunately, what I have encountered that some of these jobs are not. They're not. And I've had to assist someone in, in ensuring that her environment is a healthy environment for her to recover. You know what I'm saying? Because who wants to go to work fighting for their life and then... You know, fighting with staff, like in a toxic environment. Nobody got time for that. You know what I'm saying? So if you know somebody in your area that is like going through a tough time, they're trying to recover from a sickness or illness or whatever like that, help them out. You know what I'm saying? Be understanding. You know, have some compassion. You know what I mean? Exactly. That was a really good session. It was it was really good. It was insightful. I didn't feel like I was going to need it, but it was really good. Let me call my buddy. I haven't talked to him in a long time. I used to work with this guy. Let me see what he's up to. It's my buddy right here. Yo, yo. What's up? What up, little son? What you doing? Watching basketball. It's March Madness. Oh, what the fuck ever? Fuck you, acting on what I'm doing. You should know what niggas doing around here. Um, I didn't know it was March Madness. Damn. You know, I'm in my own world. Hey, you better get out of your world for the next three or four weeks. Three or four weeks? <laughs> Everybody in the March Madness. What? All right. Shit, I didn't know. Shit. <laughs> Why are you so happy anyway? Shut the hell up. <laughs> Did I get to see what you bought me? I can show them what you bought me. <laughs> he bought me some. He bought me some new jeans. <laughs> we was tired. Size. How do you know what size I wear? <laughs> I'm so short. You see what I'm saying? I'm gonna have to just get them taken up or whatever. Cause they. This is why I don't like buying clothes. This right here, cause everything gotta be like tailored and shit. I got time for that. They too long. My husband be meaning well. And I get it, you know, he said he saw them, they was on sale. So he just went ahead, you know, and do something for me. But I already told him that I'm going to get my own self some clothes because I already know what it takes. It's a whole process, especially like when you gain weight and when you're short, it's a whole thing. Like I gotta go try stuff on. But I appreciate his, um, I appreciate what he did.
This right here, I want to put in my living room on that like shelf that I was telling you guys about. That's what I'm thinking I'm gonna do with this. This is gonna go there. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna go see how this looks. Good morning, it's Saturday. It's a beautiful day. It's 9.30 in the morning. You, you already know what's open. These are adorable. <laughs> what does this one have on top of it? Nothing. What about this one? Oh my gosh, these are cute. It smells so good over here. Oh my gosh. This is pretty. But I don't like the way it smells, but I like the way it looks. Yeah, this is um French rose. Look at this right here. These are so cute. Look like little perfume bottles. Seven dollars. Oh my gosh, look at this. Looks like a soda. Cherry Coke. Oh, it smells good. Oh, and it's supposed to have like the little lid at the top. Look at that. Melon Fizz. It smells different. This is real pretty right here. Look at this, this is so cute. It's $10, it's freaking heavy as hell. Wow, that. Oh, Laura Ashley, y'all know how I feel about Laura Ashley. Boy, I will buy up all Laura Ashley stuff. It's a cute little bird feeder. Oh, look at these. And they're heavy. $15. These are gorgeous. Okay, they got the three different sizes right here. $10, 13 and then 15 right there. Those are pretty. This lamp is gorgeous and it's huge too. It's huge. I don't think you understand how big it is because it's it's big. Okay, eighty dollars for that lamp right there. It's very pretty. The details on it, yeah, I would totally get those. I think, yeah, that's $400 for that mirror right there. Yo, but these right here, I love these right here. $300 a piece. Those are nice. I love those. Look at the bottom, the little skirt at the bottom. Those are cute. All right, there's a cute little three piece outdoor set right there for $200. It's gray. And that's $200. Seriously, I cannot believe it's already two o'clock. Like, where did the time go? It seems like every since we sprung forward, I can't, I cannot get myself together. It's like, I need more time. Oh my gosh. These, these, I got three of these, all different sizes. Um, the small one was like, what? 10 this was 13 and the biggest one was like 15 dollars yo i love them i'm gonna put them on my coffee table just last night i was trying to figure out like what i wanted to put on the table i knew that i wanted to put candlesticks on the table 
but the candlesticks that I had to go on there, they just didn't look right. So the travertine, I think looks really, really nice with the leather, you know what I'm saying? With my leather sofa set. So, um, yeah, I think, I think that's going to be a good fit. Now let's talk about these little jars right here because these little jars, they stole my heart. Maybe it's just me because I love, I love whimsical stuff. I swear to God, I feel like I'm a fairy. <laughs> I love whimsical stuff. So those jars are like right up my alley. I was gonna take my hair down today, but the colonoscopy prep came in and I'm like, that's in two weeks. So, pooch, I'm not trying to do no hair right now. Um, oh, one more thing. I love the soap. Oh, it smells good. <sighs> Yo, Tuscan wood. I might have to find this online. I'm gonna have to find this online and buy this because. Yo, it's so. <sighs> it's amazing. <laughs> Like, it, it, it's just me. Maybe it's just me. Maybe you guys are going to like what this smells like. <sighs> but I love it. It's a clean scent. It's clean. It's a clean scent. Um, it's not, it's not citrusy. Yo, I don't know what it has up in here. But it's making me feel all the feels of just wanting to get naked and lather up in this soap and just get close to hubs or something like that smells so good oh, all right guys i'm getting ready to head to the grocery store i need to pick up a chuck roast for dinner tonight and some lima beans so that's what i'm getting ready to do now and i'll see you guys in another video real real soon